Okay, so what's up? Um, y'all, it's the the vision definitely got me. <laughs> it ain't no it ain't no easy way to say it. Um, definitely got me. Um, in the the video that I'm posting after this one, I was in the car and it's a motivation video, and I was actually coming from getting tested, and. I said in the video, I was like, I don't, I definitely don't think I got COVID. Because, first of all, I'm sleepy as shit. Let me just go ahead and put that out there. Um, damn, this really could be a vlog in itself, but I'm not going to go into all the details. I'm sleepy as fuck. <laughs> like, I've literally, that's, that's the symptom. Um, sleepy as fuck. I've been asleep for a good week. I, I just can't do nothing but sleep. Um... I have been, of course, to give me something to eat in Starbucks per usual. Luckily, you they got this thing where you can open doors with your ass, if y'all didn't know. Um, you can do a lot of different movements to where you ain't got to touch shit. Um, and they got the mobile pickup. So, yeah, I don't feel bad at all. Uh, I didn't touch nobody. But, yeah, other than that... Um, I'm tired, which I guess goes with sleeping. I'm definitely tired. Like, it don't make no sense for somebody to be this tired. Like, if fatigue was a person, I think it'll be me. I had to force myself to cut this camera on because I, I I can't sit here no longer. Um, I just found out this morning that I was positive, but I've been in the house for like a week already. So, <laughs> I got 10 more days to go. Jesus help me. I don't know how I'm going to make it. Um, I'm not a human person. I'm a very introverted person, but that's a little too introverted. Like, I, I can't even see my mama, <laughs> even though I saw her already. But nevertheless, um, what else? I think I can break it up into two videos since I got a couple of reaction videos. That's me brainstorming. See, I just... So my energy level is low. <laughs> like, that's what it all boils down to. My energy level is low. I look like shit, and I don't give a damn. Probably sound like shit, too. Um, I sound much better than I did at first. I didn't have... <clears throat> I got, like, a small cough like that right there. Cause if, and then I was going back and looking at my videos, and y'all can see that I had a cough, like, and I thought it was allergies... Because I got my booster shot on the 26th. So I was sleepy and tired thinking it was a side effect of my booster shot, which I still think it was. But then found out, what did I find out? New Year's Eve that somebody I know had COVID. Um, and that's when it's like, it's pretty much been like allergies. So I was like, well, damn, let me go get tested anyway, just in case I do. But I don't feel sick like most of the stuff that you've heard people say. Like, I don't have a fever. I don't have chills. I'm not really sneezing as much. My stomach is fine. I can taste the shit out of some food. And I can smell just fine. Um, so I don't have any, like, normal symptoms. Thank God. Um, I actually... I feel like my upper respiratory infections be worse than this. Like, this ain't half as bad as how it is when I'm really sick. Like, upper respiratory sinus infection, strep throat sick. So, I'm, I'm thankful for that. And I pray that I get better and not worse. Um, positive mindset. Hmm? Positive mindset. And I really want to be productive in this time since I am stuck in the house. But because I'm so tired, it messes with your brain activity. So it's like you can want to do something, but your brain be like, nah, I just want to sleep. Like, I didn't know a body could sleep this much. Like, I, y'all not understanding when I tell you <laughs> I've been sleep. <laughs> like, I didn't even know the human body could sleep as much as I've been sleeping. But it's been happening. So that's, that's that on that. Uh, yeah, well, you know. It happened. It happened. I can still do that part. So, got that out the way. I saw some funny shit I had to bring to y'all. Uh, and I am in my office area because I didn't feel like putting all this shit by the couch. It just wasn't happening. Because uh, 
obviously my energy level is super low. Like I must have bit down to plug in the computer and I was like, oh shit, I'm tired. Like, <laughs> so I was like, fuck it. I'm just going to do this in my desk area. Shout out to my teeny shirt too. Uh, I don't know why. There you go. Shout out Natalie. Um, but I saw this on the Karen's Gone Crazy Instagram. I got to stay off these Instagram streets. <laughs> And I, had, I'm sorry, I had to bring it to y'all. I had to, like, I just, I had to because I need us to laugh together um, at this. So this is, this is what happened when you fuck with people and you shouldn't be fucking with people. Let's, let's roll the, let's roll the video. Let me make sure I'm recording. Uh, cause I'm not doing this again. That's what's not happening. Okay. Terry from the dude that's recording is what sent me like <laughs> cause it gets what but <laughs> so she put let, let's let's get this straight and I, I respect my brethren because she put her hands on him right I, I told y'all quit doing didn't I tell you didn't y'all <sighs> so clearly nobody learned from the Steelers game we gonna, we gonna understand that nobody learned from that she put her hands on him ma'am and and women kill me with this especially white women that they have this belief that first of all <laughs> you white obviously they have this belief that they can put their hands on men period it's I, black men i don't especially but men period and not get hit back just because of the simple fact that a man shouldn't hit a woman exists right she was probably raised clearly in a racist household but she was probably raised to believe that men shouldn't hit women, which is true. But somebody failed to teach her what's called self-defense. Which means if you put your hands on somebody, they got the right to defend themselves. Okay. <laughs> they got the right. Oh, my eyes look terrible. They got the right to defend themselves. Now, homeboy, clearly he was raised right, again, and instead of hitting her, he hits the guy she with that's in the back talking shit. And that's what pisses me off. First of all, hold on. Me and Rodney not together, but I'm going to use him as an example because we still go places together. And even shit, Bobby, my brother, it don't matter. Whatever. Well... Let's go with Bobby and Rodney since since it relates to what I'm finna say. It ain't no way in hell. We finna be somewhere like this and we getting into it with somebody else and Rodney's behind me talking shit and I make the first move. Like that's not how that work. <laughs> and and we and I'm talking to a dude too. Like me, okay, I'm I'm gonna haul off anyway, but he not gonna be behind me. He he not gonna be behind me. That ain't how that work. I y'all ladies, white ladies, um, y'all got to leave these ancient niggas alone. <laughs> I'm sorry, they not niggas, but they gonna be niggas today. Y'all gotta leave these ancient niggas alone. It ain't no way, homeboy. <laughs> like, I don't know if that's her nigga or what, but he talking shit from the bike. From the back of me. Like, 
No, you supposed to be in front of me. Like you should have hit him first. If we going in this, we going together. Like you, you should have rushed him before I could even get my hands on him. Like what? What? <laughs> what is happening? So now you behind me talking shit, and he said, "Bitch, fuck you. Give me this nigga." <laughs> Rewind it. Like, let's go back. Let's go back. We gotta go back. We gotta go back. Okay. Hello. 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 Cause this shit funny as fuck. Let Let's go back. Let's. We gonna go about right there. Okay. Here we go. Oh, bitch! You thought. Boo. <laughs> Dramatic. And she's still wilder. That nigga is gone, y'all. And he just chilling like he did not just hit that nigga in the face. Girl, what you gonna do half naked with that big ass man? It's the commentary. for me like whoever was recording this my nigga you funny to the bitch cause that shit was hilarious <laughs> don't come by me don't come by me I'm not him I'm not him <laughs> I'm warning you right now bitch like here hold my shit cause if she come over here it's a wrap <laughs> whoever he was with was like don't worry about it <laughs> like I'ma choke that bitch so that she come <laughs> my thing is okay <laughs> Clearly, you didn't, you didn't, you didn't learn from an example because if he just knocked the shit out of whoever you was with, what makes you think you're going to be able to do something at this point? Like the fact that you still trying to come towards him, like you finna just do some damage. First of all, you ain't got no clothes on. When he knocked you down and your ass skid across that goddamn floor and burn up every part of your legs, you going to be crying because he didn't hit you, and he should have. He should have. Because you put your hands on him. Ma'am, he should have knocked your ass out. But instead, my man took the bigger route, and he knocked the dude out. Like, he, he was like, nah, I ain't finna go there. Boop, I'm gonna get this nigga instead. Respect, brother. Respect, because if I was a nigga and it had been me, nah, son. <laughs> Nah, son, like, nah, you, you finna get your ass hit back. You, you who hit me, you finna get hit back. And I'ma just hit that nigga just on GP just cause he was talking shit in the background. Like, I don't understand it. Like, what'd you think he was gonna accomplish? <laughs> what did you, what did you think he was gonna accomplish? And the hotel employees are clearly chilled in the motherfucker, like, they are of no help whatsoever. Like, because in their mind, they like, we don't get paid enough for this bullshit. Like, I'm not about to get hit because these motherfuckers acting crazy. Like, that's not what's finna happen. Homeboy that's on the end, the older looking dude, he for damn sure ain't finna break shit up. He like, look, I'm close to retirement. I ain't got time for this bullshit. <laughs> Fuck all y'all in this job because I'm not gonna get hit 
fooling with y'all. It's not happening. They don't pay me enough for that. They don't pay me enough. They don't pay me to be security. I don't, and even if they do, I don't get paid enough for that. Huh? No, no, no. Y'all got to learn to keep your hands to y'all <laughs> That shit was funny. I, I had to share that with y'all. I really did. Like, yeah. And I got another one coming, another video coming, um, with some other videos that I found one of them to which pissed me off and it's a two part video lord help me when I'm trying to edit that shit but yeah y'all know I got some more but that shit right there that, that was hilarious mm -hmm. he Floyd Mayweather the fuck out of that nigga like like he, he, he fucked off like I know he got a concussion like he just laid there it's nothing you can do but lay there mm -hmm. at that point you just gotta lay there you just got to take that L, my nigga. Like, he didn't even get up. He didn't move. He didn't do nothing. Like, I'm pretty sure he's unconscious. I'm pretty sure he's unconscious. Damn, he hit that nigga hard than a bitch, bro. Like, I just thought about it. Like, my face hurt. My face hurt just thinking about it. Like, <sighs> damn. He gonna have a mean ass headache. He gonna have a mean ass headache, though. Oh, well. Shit, that's what you get. <laughs> but anyway, again, I will see y'all in the next one because clearly I ain't got shit but time at this point. So if y'all see a bunch of videos of me on YouTube in the same house, possibly in the same damn outfit, because at this point, where where I'm going? Where I'm going? I ain't going nowhere. Uh, I'm I'm just chilling, just stuck. So I just talk to y'all. And at least be some type of productive because it's nothing to talk to a camera. Better than talking to myself. Okay, anyway, see y'all in the next one. Bye!